Today, heavy security out at the Johnson County Courthouse as witnesses testified against two brothers accused of gunning down a man in Overland Park. This is day two of the preliminary hearings in the case against James and Dale Willis. We dug deeper into their past and discovered both of the men have been convicted of violent crimes before all across the metro. 41 Action News reporter Ali Hoxie joins us live now from the courthouse. Ali, what happened out there today? Mike, witnesses took to the stand to describe the night that 24-year-old Droll Carter was gunned down outside the Roxy. And we dug into these brothers' lengthy criminal past. One after another, witnesses told the court they saw Dale and James Willis get into a fight with Droll Carter outside the Roxy at 75th and Metcalf. They say Dale punched Carter. However, witnesses say they did not see who pulled the trigger. I saw the shooting occur. I just didn't see any faces. We did some digging and found both men have a long history of violent crimes within Jackson County. James's past includes running from police, assault, robbery, and drug trafficking. Dale went to prison for being the leader of a drug ring selling cocaine. His other crimes include assault and robbery. You've got a limited amount of resources to use in terms of time, energy, and money. Paul Morrison is the former Johnson County prosecutor. Although the Willis's brothers' crime spree stretched all across the metro, Morris says prosecutors do look at priors to determine how violent a person is. And sometimes the wrong judgment call can be made. Pick out those folks by eyeballing those folks who you think might be the most dangerous to your community. Morrison says age does play a factor in how a prosecutor will push for jail time. James Willis is 28. Dale Willis is 33. Reporting live from Olathe, Ali Hoxie, 41 Action News.